Okay, uh, good morning. This is uh, Professor David J. De Los Reyes. Okay, uh, my topic for this session will be synthetic division or long division. Okay, uh, let's proceed. Uh, we are given a problem. Divide the quantity x cubed plus x squared minus 14x minus 24 divided by x plus 2. And what will be equal to? The problem is asking for the div division pr problem. We are given a numerator. It's a cubic equation. And we are given a denominator, which is a, a linear equation. And we are asked to divide. Uh, we term this uh, long division or so-called synthetic division. Okay, uh, let's proceed. The solution will be something like this. We will rewrite the numerator. The power of the numerator, uh, the highest power of the numerator is actually greater than the highest power of the denominator. So actually we could divide. So we will rewrite the whole numerator. Okay, the left hand side will be x plus 2. Okay, uh, let's proceed. The first answer here uh, will be, uh, uh, this is a hint. If this is a plus x cubed, think of a term that, that is, when multiplied to x, it will, it will become the same as the sine of this one. So the proper uh, uh, term for that one will be x squared. Okay. Just think of a term that's when multiplied by x, it will become x cubed. That is, so when you subtract it, it will become zero. So the first answer is actually x squared. Okay. Uh, let's multiply. x squared times x will be plus x cubed. It should be plus, right? And x squared times 2 will be positive 2 x squared. Okay? Uh, we do like this. Then we perform the operation subtraction. We subtract. Okay? That's why I told you a while ago, if what is the sign of the first term, it should be the sign of the resulting uh, product so that when you subtract it will become zero so actually if we try to subtract x cubed minus x cubed this is plus right this plus so if this is plus it does not affect the when we subtract it it will become minus right so x cubed minus x cubed it will become zero so it's a must that the first uh, term here will be plus x squared. Okay. Uh, x squared minus 2x squared. This will become minus, right? Right? Then try to take the sum. A positive x squared plus open quantity negative 2x squared. Uh, it will be something like this, x squared plus open quantity negative uh, 2x squared. Okay? If we try to take this sum of this, the operation is uh, addition, right? After inserting this negative sign, try to add, right? So it will become x squared minus 2x squared. So what will come out will be negative x squared. So this is negative x squared. Okay, sorry for that one, it drops, oh I will try to erase this one, okay the next term on the answer will be, okay, this is negative x square right, okay I will try to remove this one now, we don't need this, it is negative x square right, so the next answer should have a negative uh, sign, okay? So it should be a negative x. That is, when we multiply negative x times x, okay, it will become negative x squared. 
right? Oh, sorry for this one. Uh, we bring down negative 14 x and we bring down negative 24. Okay? The next answer will be negative x times x. It will be negative x squared. And negative x times uh, 2 will be negative 2x, right? And again, perform the operation subtraction. So if we try to perform the operation subtraction, okay, this will become plus, and this will become plus, okay? Then try to add negative x squared, it's the same, and negative x squared plus open quantity x squared. It is plus. So negative x squared, a plus in a plus will still be a plus, so this is plus x squared. So the sum is actually zero. So this is zero. Okay? So a negative x squared plus x squared, this will now be zero, or this will be gone. And a negative 14x plus 2x will be negative 12x. This, neg this is now negative 12x. The, the next answer will be, it should be same as the sign of this negative 12 here. So it should be negative 12. So negative 12 times x will be negative 12x. I will remove this one. It's negative 12x. And a negative 12 times a positive 12 will be negative 24. Right? Then again, try to perform the operation subtraction. If the operation is subtraction, this will become plus, and this will become plus. Okay? Then try to take this up. A negative 12x plus 12x, it will be 0. And a negative 24 plus 24 will be 0. And actually, the remainder... Here is actually zero. As soon as the remainder is zero, uh, we have arrived already at the final answer. So the resulting answer now will be after the division. This is the answer now. It will be an x squared minus x minus 12. That's our final answer. Okay, uh, that is the way how we divide a, what they call this a a numerator and denominator if the power on the numerator is greater than the power on the denominator. And we call that uh, long division or synthetic division. Uh, good morning from Los Angeles.